hey guys what's up welcome to my youtube channel and without wasting your time let's go with the caption of this video so let's flash carbon room this video is all about step by step procedure to flash the carbon room in your nexus 6p make sure it's nexus 6p only and to flash carbon room you need to download the packages like room and open g apps that's more than enough for this if you are not sure where to download the files you can look into my description or else just stay tuned with this video to download those files to download those files you can either open the web page or just go to the google now and say please open the web page of carbon room opening web page as soon as the web page opens, you can see it's we are back. That means Carbon Room community was away from Android community for some time and they just come back with the AOSP 7.1 now jet. And here are the supported device list 6, 6P, Pixel, Shield, Xperia, Xperia 3, Xperia 5. So this video is all about Nexus 6P. So let's go ahead and click this to download the files. And here the name is Angular for Nexus 6P and you can see the file is available here. So just click that and you will be getting the ROM file. And when I click this file now looks like some issue is there to download the file. I have posted the direct link in my description. After downloading the ROM file you need to download the G apps. So let's go ahead there. Please open the web page of OpenG Apps. Opening web page. Here you need to select ARM64 for Nexus 6P and 7.1 for Android. And you can choose which one stock it will be 744MB and full 624MB. So I have taken the stock room and just click the download button. That's it. And it will download the GApps file. Now we have both the files. I mean to say room file and we have the open GApps file. So let's go ahead and flash this room. So let me go to the recovery. So whenever you are in the TWRP recovery or any kind of recovery, make sure you backup, backup, backup your room. So go ahead and backup. So you can select all the partitions, whichever you want. I suggest you select all the partition and just go with swipe to backup. Since I have already taken the backup, I will just go ahead and flash the room. The next step is like you need to wipe you can just go ahead advanced wipe select these except internal storage and just swipe it out so since i have already done it let me just go ahead go back and go ahead with installing the package i mean room so here i have carbon room and open g apps package so let's click the carbon room and add one more chip which is our open g apps and let's flash it out it will be having just two or three steps formatting systems extracting systems and another two steps will be there with just a symbol of c which is nothing but carbon room So guys it took nearly seven minutes to flash only the gapps package and if i can show you so let me show you that i have just flashed the room and then here is the gapps package it's a huge package took nearly seven minutes to complete so let's just wipe catchy and dalvi catchy for once again and reboot the system so do not install let's go ahead and reboot the system
so guys it took nearly five minutes to boot up the phone after flashing the room along with stock gapps which is a huge package so i have done all the initial setup i have also uh, done with the setup of fingerprint so let's go ahead and unlock this device with my fingerprint so it does works perfectly without any lag so as soon as you unlock the device you have a very very cool screenshot screen image which is nothing but who is back so let's go ahead and see what are the things there so we came to the settings and let's go ahead and check the about phone uh, it shows carbon room so after pressing we will have a, another cool image carbon room logo over here it's good let's go ahead and see and at 7.1 okay it's now it confirmed so other things are same status we have battery level 41 percent and coming from the top to the bottom we have the wi-fi there is no issue when connecting to the wi-fi it connected us very well then we have bluetooth it was working fine i have even checked the bluetooth over the headset i mean bluetooth headset is connecting fine and coming to the data usage i have used the uh, network also so when i go to the cellular networks we have 2g 3g 4g all the three were perf working perfectly without any issue and then coming to the more setting here we have nfc since i don't use nfc let me just disable it other things like network re setting reset everything is working perfectly here then we have the customization of carbon room so we have a lock screen and i just enable this one and lock the device long pressing the power button it gives you the touch light again long pressing it just switches off the touch light let's go ahead with the miscellaneous settings we have screenshot type take full screenshot or drag selection on the area you want to take a screenshot then we have a navigation navigation is all like our button settings we have a privacy hide apps from recents so we can add an apps which will not show in your recent apps over here okay so let's go back and we have a status bar quick setting here we have an option to enable one tap action for enabling and disabling the data so that's a good option uh, and also vibrate on touch when touching these tiles so when you touch this you will feel a touch uh, we also have a traffic indicators so when we enable this we can see some here you can see the traffic right fine then we have system settings power menu so you can enable some of the options like screen record so when you just press the power button you will have a screen record options so there are many options in, uh, included just make sure you uh, try it by yourself then we have a carbon st statistics like reporting your issues all those things it will take previewing the data how the ticket will be created all those things then coming to the display perfectly works adaptive brightness you can see that right so it works fine and we have anything new here ambient display so ambient display also works fine yes it's fine so let me just unlock yes done and then other things are normal 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 uh, we have anything else so we have the developer options it's just normal as other rooms uh, i haven't found anything new here so we have the system ui tuner enabled by default where you can just uh, may i mean customize the system uh, status bar here status bar so you have ethernet cellular data all those things and you have do not do not disturb mode you have a navigation bar once again and other things like power notification controls 
so these things are normal which uh, you, knew, you knew it and so that's all about the carbon room everything works fine here in the settings and coming to the performance it feels as buttery smooth as other i mean all other uh, uh, rooms which are which i have used it and you have a pixel launcher by default and is there anything else here you have a status bar i mean quick settings you can just tap on this and rearrange it fine and let me just show you up a small game how does it performs on the carbon room so let's play the game okay it's working fine right good so i have used this room for another uh, i have used this room for two hours and there was there were no issues at all till that i mean all the call features and uh, if i ask about the receiving and sending the messages everything was perf working perfectly going to the play store and installing the apps it was no issues at all and going to the chrome apps you can even play the youtube video without any issue so let me just play one video okay it's working fine so for a normal user it's working fine and i can even suggest you like it's a daily driver room only though it is in this nightly stage nightly room so go ahead and flash carbon room and post your comments in my youtube channel so that i can answer your questions and coming to the camera part the camera also works fine so here is an image it's good going to the video video works fine good so that's all you need it you need a call you need the wi-fi to be connecting you need the mobile network to be connecting i mean you need also the airplane mode to work fine flash mode is for flashing light is working fine hotspot is working fine i mean for a general user it's working fine I mean there is no issue at all I am not sure uh, what are other features that are missing it out and might be uh, carbon room community will be building up new features and let's go into the Google talking talking engaging in speech okay please open the web page of carbon room it's working fine opening web page cool so don't forget so guys so guys don't forget to subscribe my channel and comment your ways comment your views um, that's all about the carbon room